hey everyone welcome back to our channel so here we are going to start a new series on lookup functions in MS Excel and in the first episode in the first very episode we are going to discuss the most useful lookup functions that is used in MS Excel that are VLOOKUP and HLOOKUP so what are we waiting for let's start now understanding from the names VLOOKUP and HLOOKUP the lookup means uh, it represents we are looking for something for some data for some number or for some names or some text from some uh, large database table multiple columns right this is what lookup is, is representing but what is V and what is H so V represents vertical and H represents horizontal so what vertical and what horizontal so vertical means if the database is given in vertical format like this there are salaries ranges and the tax rates let me just give it some, some names salary range and tax rates so this data is provided in vertical format and the same data is also already provided in horizontal format these are salary range and tax rates so whenever we are going to look up from this data this vertical data we are going to use VLOOKUP function and if you are going to use this one data then we are going to use HLOOKUP function and now uh, one more thing that I have uh, written down in definition part intro part that is approx match and exact match so what exactly it is uh, so it represents when the exact value is not given and we are looking for just approx value approx match value that is lump sum that value then that match is taken and what is exact match and in, in this case we are just going for we are just looking for the exact match into a uh, database and uh, while using the VLOOKUP and HLOOKUP we are provided uh, both these options uh, whether we want to use approx match or only for exact match so we are going to learn both of these things in this video so stay tuned in let's start so let's start with the first example where we have our data of employee names along with their security number salaries and the tax rates which are blanks because we have to fill it up with the use of lookup function so where we have to look it up from this data table uh, that is in vertical format uh, provided salary ranges and tax rates and we can also look it up from this one that is in horizontal format but the same thing there are salary ranges and tax rates so one more thing that you have to rem remember that we are going to use approx match here not exact match why reason the reason behind is that very simple these figures the salary figures like 63981 60915 do not exactly match with these salary ranges when it comes to 55000 and tax rate is 3% uh, at that and after that there is uh, 65000 only uh, for which tax rate is 3.5% there is no in between there is no between numbers right so that is why we have to use approx match because if we use the exact match our numbers will not tally and it will provide us error so now let's start with the formula by coming here d3 I will press equals to now press b l so it is providing me option to just choose the lookup function that I want I'll just press tab and now 
it is asking what I am looking for so I am looking for the salary right so I will just select C3 and now press comma so it is asking me the table array in which I am looking for this lookup value so this is the table array I am looking for uh, not looking for but in which I am looking for my lookup value I will select this table array so there are just two column uh, table here it could be three four five six and also there could be multiple rows uh, thousands of rows here but yeah it is a simple uh, one uh, now I will just press comma and now it is asking for the column index number so which index number so which column index number I am uh, looking for this lookup value so what I want is this text rates and in this table in this G2H table this H column is second table second uh, uh, column so I will type 2 this is the number of columns up in, uh, in which I am looking for my data and I will just now press comma so it is asking me what I, whether I am looking for approx match or uh, exact match approx match uh, if I am looking for approx match it will asking me to uh, choose true otherwise uh, false so I am looking for approx match now so I'll just select true and now bracket close and now press enter so now it is providing me the text rate of 0 0.03 uh, which is 3% only but uh, but the problem here is I haven't selected percentage format so I will just select percentage format and yeah it is providing me the same figure of 3% now I want to drag this formula up to the last row before doing that I have to freeze the data range by pressing F4 on both of these things both of uh, range numbers G2 and H16 and now press OK now copy this formula go below to the last uh, row uh, and now paste it so see I have successfully pasted my formula up to the last row and get the text states so yeah as simple as that and now we are going to discuss about HLOCO formula for that I will just press equals to H L now it is asking me whether I want this formula so yes I want this formula I'll just press tab on it and now it is asking for the lookup value again it is C3 that is my salary press comma and in this case it is asking me table range as uh, in the VLOOKUP formula so in this case our uh, table range will be in horizontal format so I have selected this table now press comma again and now it is asking row index number instead of column index number in case of we look up formula it was asking me column index number because these were in columns now it is asking me row index number because these are in rows this data is in rows cell range and tax rates and in this case again my first column is salary range and second column is tax rates and tax rates is what I have wanted to be fill in to be looked up uh, into this data and yeah it is in second column into this data range so I will press 2 now again comma now it is again asking me true or false whether it is approximate or exact match so I will press tab on approx match again now yeah press enter 
So see, we have successfully added HLOCO formula in this data. Now I want to paste it um, up to this row, up to the last row. Now I have to freeze this data range before copying this formula. Now I will copy this formula and paste it up to the last row. So see, we have successfully added HLOCO formula into this. So coming to our next example, here we are going to use exact match instead of approx match. And we have our data here of names, ratings and the numerical scores uh, which are empty and we have to fill it up with the use of VLOOKUP and HLOOKUP. And in this uh, case we are going to use exact match instead of approx match because the number we are looking for, like not a number but the text we are looking for in this case like rating we have fair, satisfactory, good, poor these are completely matching with the number uh, I mean the text from the lookup table like this one it have the exact values, exact texts like excellent, very good, good, satisfactory all these things are exactly matching and it will provide us accurate results so let's see how to do this I'm going to use VLOOKUP now equals to VLOOKUP everything will same uh, remain same lookup value this is my lookup value that's E2 saying fair and no comma the table array so I will choose the table array now this is my table array and yeah press comma again the column next number so in our data this is the column number one and this is the column number two so it is asking me the column next number from which we wanted the results so we want the results from column number two so I will just press two and now comma and approximate to exact match what I want here is exact match and press tab and press enter now we have successfully get our uh, results the fair equals to 71 numerical score so it is 71 now I will freeze my data table from which I am getting the figures and I press enter copy this formula up to the point up to the last row and paste it like you had done before so this one for we look up exact match and now we will use actual look up look up value will be again fair but this time our table array will be in this horizontal format and now it is asking for row index number now what is so row index number uh, it is it is asking me from which uh, row number I am getting I am expecting my results so this in this uh, horizontal format table our first row is the ratings and our numerical score is in row number 2 in this table so I will press 2 and comma and go for exact match and now bracket close center now I will read this formula press enter copy this formula and paste it up to the point of, of the last row and yeah so yes everyone this is it for today we have discussed about we look up and its approx match approx and exact match and also we have discussed about H lookup and its approx and exact match so yes guys this is it for today and 
If you like our content, please like, subscribe and share this video with your friends who are struggling with Excel. And if you want to practice these things, you can check for the link uh, in your description bo box where you can find all these files uh, for your practice. And yeah, thank you. See you in next video. Bye.